What is up guys, it is Nick. We are back and we are here to, uh, I have to pull up the quest. We're here in Tidium Valley. I wish I could pull it up on the map, but obviously we're in the middle of, no, we're like down here. We're here, I think. Don't honestly, I think. We, we need the fog and oil and desert fog and seer. I'm gonna really hope that, I mean, I assume that's where I am because I can see the yellow um, circles for the quest, but let's get that equipped again. It is, uh, choir, no, wait, that's Calfian. Um, where is, okay, I believe, I don't even know which quest it is anymore. Ah, uh, it's down here. It's the second suggestion. So, yeah, it won't let me navigate, so I can't even select it anymore. But what we're trying to do is we're trying to get this. We need the second suggestion here for the Valencia. I'm hoping we're in the right spot. I hate the desert with a burning passion. If we're not, then we're going to be in trouble. I also went ahead and respect the character. We went for succession. I looked up some videos. It's a little easier combos and stuff like that. We obviously need to get a lot more skill points. Um, the person in the video had like 2,000, so I need to get more skill points, but it should be easier to use. Now, it's going to take me... It was going to take me a while to get used to regular... Um, regular uh, awakening anyway, so yeah. It doesn't really matter that this is going to look awkward to start with, but for right now... What am I getting absolutely beamed by? What is hitting me over here? Okay, so this is Desert Foggin, so this should be able to complete that quest. I don't know how... I'll have to stop and, like, take a look, because I'll probably miss it. But yes, the mobility I really like, and it still uses some of my favorite abilities, like that one. And so, yeah, definitely going to be using it going forward, the succession. And I just like that mob to mob mode. I mean, like, look at that. That just nukes them off the planet. And this skill doesn't really have a cooldown. So if I want to, I can just sit here and spam the skill. That's actually, like, really good. Okay, maybe... Oh, I ran out of... See, I have to work on that. That's the one thing. So what I need to work on um, is when I... When I do i need to work on dark trading and then popping it because then it gives me back that mana points if i have enough um what i try to say if i have enough um health if i'm not dealing with health issues then that should be what i should be doing every time it should clean it up fairly easily and it just should be what i do but we also have some of these passives you need to put on prime abyssal vanguard and then my Shield of Darkness, the two buffs, the two main buffs. Now, like this, it's on there, but it's really not important. I just didn't have anything else. And it was one of the suggestions that people had for Sork um, Succession, is to have that in your hotbar. Though the X, like, on Xbox, having the hotbar, like, this was the skill that it wanted on the hotbar, but... On Xbox, it's just a simple tap of Y after, like, rushing crows or a various multitude of random crap. So, it's like, yeah, you don't actually really need to do that. But I need to work on, like, dark trading into that so I can have, get it back faster. But yeah, it'll be, it'll be a learning experience here. And I know, like, the kicks and stuff is, is very important that I need to work on those. And like that, that's a skill I need to use for like, massive CC to get people out of here. I don't know why I didn't let me do it. After. But yeah, it's just going to take a lot of practice. I think I like the Sword Succession a lot better than the regular Sword, even though I was a big fan of the Scythe. I think this is probably a better move overall for me. Could be wrong, but I think it's I think it's gonna be for the better. A good switch. And it's a pretty good for PV PvE stuff. It's not like flawless, but it's it's pretty good. But yeah, I need to work on my accuracy. I go I fly past some enemies sometimes, or I fly like 
again, like, I'll do the... a second one or something like that, and it flies me, like, way past where I was trying to get to. But yes, this is... Fa it's fairly easy to play, and so that's... that's one of the better parts of this. And I just like... I like the skills. Like, that skill, fun to use. The issue is still that I'm really bad at managing my mana. And, like, swapping the dark trade and then doing this. I still gotta get used to it. Because I'm still pretty bad at it. But I think, you know, over... Give me some time, we'll figure it out. But yeah, I run out of stamina a lot, and so it's gonna be... It's just gonna be a lot of uh, practice. See, like that, I was a little short of where I wanted to be. It's just gonna... Yeah, it's just gonna take time. And I need to use the... Not Dark Trade, the... I forget what the skill's name is. The left bumper skill that gives me back Mon. I just need to use that as much as I can. As I get stuff, I gotta pop it. Am I taking damage from the... Do I need to drink water? Probably what I need to do. I don't know the rotation at this part. Of... I've done Desert Foggins before, but I don't remember... I don't remember what the rotation for... Like, there's a spot that's, like, way better than this. But I don't remember what it is. I just need to make sure when I go back to um, town, I have a bunch of stuff I need to do in town anyway when I get back that I noticed. And um, someone pointed it out, and I very much appreciate it. I will be getting the Kaposha gear on this character as soon as we have to head back to Kama. I'm not going to walk one of these characters all the way across the map or, or some whatever. I'm not going to take them all the way across the map to switch the gear. I obviously, I don't need it to do these quests. I'm plenty powerful enough. I, like, two-shot these Falcons. Um, so I just, I don't need to do it right now, but eventually I will. And so when, when, it, when we get there, I'll, I'll mess with it. But, like, right there, I should have done, I should have done the Dark Trade before that, not right there. I, like, got to them and I was like, oh, hey, I'm out of, I'm out. I probably need to just predictively guess it, because, like, I'm gonna use it, so... Like, we all know I'm gonna use up my mana, I'm just terrible at the, the, the management of it. Like, see, I ran out of it there. I need to either get on a rotation of pressing the button to... Because to do it, I have to dark trade, and then I have to left bumper. So I either need to get into the habit of doing that, or I need to get into the habit of... Um... Say, get in the habit of just pushing the over button. Like right there, when I'm in that animation, when I'm up in the air, it lets you use it while you're up in the air, so I should just be pushing the over button. Like every third time I do that. I don't need to do it every time, but like every third time I do it, I should probably be um, giving myself more. But we can also, I mean, you can we can dark trade into it, but... I have to figure out. I just still have to figure this out because I still don't wanna. It's still there's one spammy ability that's pretty darn good, and that's just to dash to the thing and then hit Y, and then it pretty much kills everything. I hadn't gotten that quest completed yet. Okay, so that quest is complete. I don't really know how to get out of here because I came from up there, so I'll have to figure that out. Um, I don't really wanna. I normally would stay here to farm, but these guys aren't overly like. Over and, over. and I need to use the kicks more. There's a bunch of, like, that stuff I need to do more, but... Yeah, it's gonna take a little bit of a learning. Obviously, I was used to my old rotation, even if I couldn't perfectly remember it or anything. I still was used to that, um, rotation. So, hopefully... Yeah, like, see, I ran out there. I should have dark traded and done it there beforehand, but that's okay. Why is it not laying the I need to use this skill more, too. I mean, it's kind of hard to use. I'm gonna get my uh, mana back and then... Like, can I dash in and use that? Like, if I dash in here... 
I can. You can dash it. Oh, no, it does this one after the dash. Hmm. Interesting. Because I would use... Oh, my gosh. Is this... This is a way out. Okay. But, like, so... Let me see here. So, if I dash in... Yeah, it wants to do that skill, which is not the skill I want it to do. So, if I just quick... Yeah, see, it doesn't do it. So, if I dash in... Yeah, it wants to do this version of it. I think I have to be, like, stationary standing to do the other one. Which is alright, but not really what I want to do. Can my pets get to work picking up? Hello? But yes, this is much better. The rotation of skills that I need to use are is not, like, overly ridiculous. Now, I know I'm supposed to use, like... Abyssal Flame and some of that other stuff. I think. Is it? Yeah, Midnight Stinger is LTRB. Um, I'm trying to see. Not Mark of Shadow. Yeah, like Abyssal Flame is RBRT, which I need to use. I just gotta work on it. We just gotta get practice. I think that's pretty much it. Discover Tidium Valley. Definitely came to Tidium Valley before. But, yeah, so it's just gonna be... And I do like, you can cancel out of this with, uh... What did I just cancel it out with? I forgot what I just canceled it out. Is it left trigger? I think it's left trigger. Hold on. Okay, hold on. <laughs> I was like... I don't even remember what I just... I think it's... Is it A? Is it, hold on. Is it A forward? What is it? I just can't... Yeah, it's A forward. You can cancel out of it with with A... It might be A left trigger forward. Let me try it again. Yeah, it's left trigger A forward cancels out of that skill. So if you finish off... Let's see here. Let me get some back. So if you finish off, you can... Oh my god, I fucked it up again. <laughs> ah, okay. 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 So... Why? Yeah, yeah. So if you kill him with the first ones, you can, you can, you can. Um, I can't even think. You can cancel out of it, which is fairly good. But I'm fairly happy with this. It's gonna take a decent chunk of getting used to. Probably, I would say with. I need these quests to be like fighting enemy quests because then it'll let me get used to it a little bit more because right now a lot of these quests are just run and talk to or do this and talk to this dude and that doesn't help anyone dark trade probably not the best time to do that see i still gotta get used to it. it's, just, it's just a matter of getting used to it i want to get like these combos down the basic ones first and then i'll try to add in like abyssal flame. like i would love to do abyssal flame but it's kind of like a... It kind of just... It's awkward on the controller. I should probably put Abyssal Flame instead of Scattering Shadow, but they kind of are similar in locate... Like, I don't... They're similarly annoying to use. And, like, the kicks. I just am not used to kicking. How do I get out of here? I feel like we're just running for miles, and I can't get out of here. It's just a long, circular canyon. A long circular, a long straight line canyon. See, I should have dark traded, and then I should have done this, and then that. But yes, I, it, it's better. I like it a lot better. It's just gotta, I say, it. I need to find a spot where I can, like, climb up. Just get out of here. Okay, well, I'm gonna cut ahead here. We've been doing this for 14 minutes. I feel like we should do something else in the episode except me talk about how I suck at the succession thing and then how I'm going to work on practicing it. So, yeah, we need to figure out how to get out of here. So I'll be back when we get to something else that's interesting, which is probably going to be another find, go run far away, find a quest and, and kill. But I will, I will figure it out. I'll get out of here and uh, we'll, we'll progress. I should probably just keep farming on my way out. I mean, there's no harm in it. We're gonna make a little bit of money, and this is... this isn't a way out. Why are you here, gatekeeper? 
Why are you the only one? Oh my gosh, are you actually this strong or am I just... I don't have enough knowledge, so you... I think he's this strong. He is this strong. Oh my gosh, he does a lot of damage. Oh my gosh, I just realized how much damage he did. Why is this guy so... Why is this guy so... Oh, pay! Oh my god, this guy hit for so much damage. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me, leave me alone. I need to put my buffs back on. Where is he? What the... What the... Kite in a circle and... Right? I can't get... I'm in a corner. Oh my god. Get me out of the corner. Dude, you get out of up there. It's like hard to hit you up there. Thank you. Come down here. Stop being weird. Come down here. Come on. Come on. This is not fun. Why is he so OP? I'm backing it up. I'm backing it up. Backing it up. Backing it up. I don't know how that missed me. I have, like, no stamina now. Okay, I'm gonna dash over here. Alright, come back up top here. You can bring that one guy with you. I actually... Oh, no, I didn't. That hit me. That hit me, too. How strong... Oh, wait. No, he's not dead. How strong are you, dude? Dude, he's OP. He's OP. Why is he OP? Okay. He's immune. By the way, immune. Right behind him there. Focus. I got like hardcore focus on this because I'm getting slammed. Okay, 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 okay. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Five seconds. Dude, honestly, I have revival items. Like a ton of them. Um, let's just use one of these. Loss will be restored. I have a bunch of shit in my inventory, so I should probably not be dying to this guy. Let me get out of here. I probably should have resurrected at the closest node, to be honest. Okay, did I, like, lose anything? I have a bunch of, like, stuff. Uh, doesn't look like it. Dude. Seriously? Seriously, Sentry? Are we going for round two? We go... Do I have... Do I really hate myself enough to go for round two here? He just hit so hard, I can't do it, I can't do it, I can't do it. I don't even know... If I had, like, some knowledge on him and I could tell if he got his health back or not, I would... I would do it. But I can't even tell if he got his health back from my little runaway right there. So, why is my weapons away? What is it doing? Like, I don't know how these guys are, like... So easy, and then he's just over there, just slamming me into the ground. But yeah, I'm gonna get. Speaking of not being strong enough, we will get that Kaposha as soon as I have to head to Gamma. I'll go to whatever town that my Nova's in, and we'll we'll meet up with my Nova and switch the gear over. But yes, I definitely need that gear. I actually didn't realize how much better it was than Azula's. Kind of had forgotten what Azula's stats looked like. So, yeah, I definitely need to get that switched over. I literally do not know how to get out of here, so... Yeah, I'm gonna spend the next, like, hour trying to figure out how to get... Can I just climb out? Wait, I might have clutched it. Because I can cross over right there, if I can climb this. Can I clutch it? Can we climb this? I think we can. There's gotta... There'll be a spot where I can jump. Okay, okay, okay. I have successfully gotten almost out of here. But yeah, I'll see you guys in a moment. We'll have something. I'll find something else for us to do. <laughs> That's not me climbing up a rock face. 
praying to get out of here. See, it look, it works. He's gotta, he's gotta find the most awkward ways to get out of here. Okay, I'll see you guys in a second. All right, so we are back to wrap up the episode today. Uh, we are way over here now at the Gaza Bandits Lair. We're still working on the quests. Um, we're still working on the Val the Valencia. We're almost done. I'm so close. I'm gonna try to finish them up tonight. We probably, I might skip showing some of it. I mean, it hasn't been anything, but you can see we are so close. I don't know if any of this is going to require us to kill anything. Investigate using the shovel. No, for God's sake. Um, I don't think that does the same method. That doesn't sound like it involves fighting. I don't think that involves fighting. And then Clean Revenge. Clean Revenge probably does. But maybe I'll start that within the... I don't know. We'll see. I, I don't know if I'll show any of that or whatnot. But we got to clean out some of these guys here. Um, and we got to get... What do we need? We need a record piece from a Sandstorm Plunderer, a Sandstorm Assassin, and a Sandstorm uh, Rifleman. So hopefully... Trap. Actually increased our knowledge of the trap. That's nice. We get a little bit of combat in here, which is, which is very nice. Very nice. Alright, let me beat that thing to death. Okay. Kill you. Kill the plunderers. Not doing a whole lot of great... Not doing a whole lot of great combat skills here, but... It's, been, it's actually been like since it's been like hours since I've actually fought. I haven't had to fight anything in any of this because all of it's been find and seek and run across the map and do this. This quest is really boring. Like, like okay, I get it. You want to do like you want to do story quests that aren't all fighting. That's fine. But can you give me a little bit because? These quests are atrocious. Like, literally atrocious. This has got... Wait. I thought Gaza Bandit's Lair was actually kind of, like, midway decent. Now, I'm not saying it has to be, like, good. But I'm talking, like, I thought it was, like, midway decent. But this is pretty, like, small and not good at all. I mean, the mobs are not terribly split up. And so I, I think you could get away with farming this. Is my weight my capacity is over? Um, one of those... Let me go up on the hill over here. Hopefully nothing follows me. Okay. Yeah, my character, because I bought a bajillion shovels. Let's drop, let's drop some, uh, how do I drop? Remove it. Why? Let's remove like 280 of these. I mean, they're not expensive and I don't think I need that many. I do need a handful. I'll obviously, I used 20. I bought 500. I did take a bunch of stuff out of my inventory, too, but let's go ahead and drop 25 of these, and we'll drop 33 of these, and okay, that gets our inventory to a more respectable, respectable limit size. Okay, so let's go back up here, see if he has anything or if he's going to send us back, and then I'll probably farm for just a few minutes, just like two minutes or something like that, and then we'll call it an episode. Not what I wanted to do. I wanted to interact with you. Okay. So now, Golden Desert Coin. Back into the desert I go. I can thoroughly tell you, I hate every literal second that I spend in the desert. Yeah, yeah, back in the desert we go. Is there more than one spot? Please tell me it's just that one spot. Okay, 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 that's not bad. I can live with that. It, do I like it? No. I hate going in the desert, but, but... One spot better than, like, earlier when we had to go and search through, like, six spots, and I just wanted to die the whole time. I want to figure out, like, um, different... I want to get some more skill points so that I can unlock some more skills, because these are just the, like, required... You should have these if you're going to play this class type of skills, and so I want to wanna see what other things I can incorporate here. Him out. I think I'm just gonna set my navigation point back to and we'll fight our way out of here. If I can find a 
Let's see, we just gotta get back, like, there. Okay, so we're gonna fight our way out of here, and then when I get to where there's no enemies, we'll call it an episode. Because I feel like it's gonna be a while again until I fight something, and then I don't want to get, like, caught where I want to, I need to be done for the day, and I can't end the video because there's no content. You don't want that. I don't know. The kicks? I, the kicks are important, I think. I don't know if they're that important for PvE. They might be more important when I get to, like, higher difficulty stuff. But right now, they just seem like I just don't need them. But we'll see as I go if they serve a bigger point. They very well might. Did I... Is this a different way than I just came from? How that guy just avoided that. Okay, dude. Seriously, Rifleman, why don't you leave me alone? What I need to also start doing is leaving... Like, when I have one random dude alive that has, like, one health, I need to start leaving them. Because there's absolutely no reason that I should waste my time to kill one guy. It's not worth the experience. And it's not worth the time. Much more efficient to just go to the next mob pack, kill them, and then keep moving on. See, like, I just got, I gotta get the management down. That's all we're really, that's that's my main focus right now, is managing that, the, the, the man. I either have to go with the potions, or I have to be better with the, with the swapping back and forth to, like, to dark trade and then to pop it to actually get it back. I need to either I have to get down with that or I have to get down with pushing over on the D-pad every time to restore the restore it that way. Because one way or the other, all these skills really use a lot of that. And so I need to Yeah, I need to be prepared. I do like how that just instant nukes a a mob. Nitro is so weird to me. I need to get used to I just need to get used to the skill. So it looks like looks like we're out, guys. So I know the main portion of this video is that opening part, but I thought I'd come back in, wrap it up with this little quest here, and uh show us show you my progress on Valencia. Not a whole lot going on here. I guess this episode we did finally switch over to Succession Sorceress. Gonna keep working through it. Right now, we're just trying to progress through all these, and then once I get to starting to grind a lot, and regularly, like, like I can go to a grind spot, I think the first thing I'm going to do once I finish the quests as far as I can finish them, is I'm going to go to a grind spot and do like a three or four hour grind session so that I can practice and work on stuff and just show like the progress over like four hours and then we can do that every once in a while and stuff like that while we try to progress up but that's gonna do it for this video guys i hope you all enjoyed it drop a like if it did subscribe if you haven't and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace